to learn how to make mega cash in your business. I'm not talking about my money anymore. I'm talking about your business. And so there are about eight of these. I'm going to do them back to back over the next seven, eight days. Oh, absolutely. Live streaming is part of that kingdom couture. But again, I'm not counting her money. I'm counting my money and I'm counting your money. So what are you going to do? What are you going to do in this live stream world? And that's the question that's on the table. So today, part one, we're talking about content. Because unless you have something to scope, uh, live, stream about, then you cannot go live. And let me tell you the mistake people make. The mistake people make is that they think they can just go live. So I'll say, hey guys, I make a lot of money going live. You should go live. You should get into a class and learn how to do it the right way. Mm -mm. People feel like they don't need no help. So they just go live and they mess it up. It has taken me over a year to learn how to utilize live to generate uh, revenue. And if you're not careful, you're going to make mistakes. Period. So let's talk about what you need in your content. Hey, Keisha, number one, your content has got to be fresh every day. Look at your neighbor and say fresh. And it can't just be fresh to you. It's got to be fresh to the people that you're getting in front of. And I see people who either uh, steal content because they don't know how to create their own and I'm going to tell you, it got so bad at one point. Hey, Jewel, it got so bad at one point that I could go live at seven and see two or three people in my broadcast. And by 10 o'clock that night, people had used some version of what I talked about that day because they did not know how to create their own fresh content. Charlene said, should you go live every day? Do you want money every day? Should you go live every day? Do you want money every day? To me, that's a no-brainer. If you haven't shared, make sure you share this. I will go live in the morning, and by 10 o'clock that night, there will be multiple people who had used my same, and I saw them in my scope. They used my same theme, they use my same points. And, and guess what? I don't care because it wasn't fresh. They didn't have fresh content. So let me just give you a little bit of the background in how many videos I've had to create fresh content for. And if you want these, if you want the list that I'm working for, go to bit.ly, excuse me, Go, text the word SCOPE to 832-447-2822. Oh, I wasn't worried about it. But it's the point that I'm making is that people will take your titles. They will take your topics. They will take your subjects. They will take all of that and try to run with it because they don't know how to create their own fresh content. So number one. You've got to have fresh content. And Lord knows as much money as I've made online, it was through trial and error. And that's right, Kingdom Couture. A lot of people don't think they have that much to say. I've made over 2,000 videos in the last year. Look at your neighbor and say, wow. In the last year, I've made over 2,000 videos on Periscope. And I've made over a thousand videos on Facebook because I didn't start Facebook until six months later. But the bottom line is that where do you get content for 2000 videos? I teach you how you've got to learn. Maya Angelou says creativity is the one thing that you never run out of. See, most of you are so institutionalized from working jobs and doing the same thing over and over 
that you've forgotten that God gave you a brain. And when you start to use that brain and I start to challenge you and show you how to come up with content like the back of your hand, hey, Jeremy, you won't struggle with it. So number one, you got to have content. It's got to be fresh. Number two, it's got to be relative. I see cooks scoping about the weather. I see daycare owners scoping about animals. Let me show you how to make relative content so that the content always relates back to your brand. Let me tell you another thing about, uh, about relative. You can go out there and scope about what you want to scope about. The bottom line is that if it's not relative to the people in your circle and the people that follow you, then you're just talking to thin air. I remember there's a, there's a saying that says a leader without followers is someone who's just out for a walk. I'm going to repeat that a leader without followers is someone who's just out for a walk. If you're leading and no one is following, you're just out walking, boo. You are, you're just out taking a walk. You ain't leading nobody nowhere. And until you can get to the heart of what's important to the people that you're leading, this is not a you show. This is a we show. And what that means is that when I go live, I got to go live and, and talk about what is relative to you. And if I miss that point, that's number two, Ishamine. If you just exercise and tell them, Sharon, hey, Apostle Tracy. And if I miss that point, then it's futile. My attempt is futile. My time has been wasted. And guess what? I might as well have not went live at all. And that's real. And that's something that we don't have enough of is we don't have enough leaders. So number one, your content has to be fresh. Number two, it's got to be relative to your audience. And let me tell you guys another thing. Hey, Ava, let me tell you guys another thing. If you think that you're going to get to the top of the pile, by being afraid of hitting that live broadcast button. You're wrong. If you could go back five years ago when YouTube first started, all of the people that got on YouTube then, hey, L, and stayed on YouTube are now multi-millionaires. Do you guys know that? Look at your neighbor and say, wow. They are now multi-millionaires because they led the pack. They are pioneers. If you're afraid to be a leader, this is not the game for you. And now people are not as, as keyed up on, on YouTube. They want to see you live. They want to see you make mistakes. They want to see you pull your wig off because you think the camera is off. That, that's what people are. That's why reality shows are so hot. This is nothing more than a reality show. So I'm, I'm going to ask you a question. Do you want to be first? Here's the thing. You're either going to go live now or you're going to do it later and be a follower. So choose now or later. Type it in. <clears throat> Type it in now or later. You're either going to go live now and be a pioneer, be a leader, make the money. Or you're going to wait until the tides have turned and everybody is live and everybody's doing it. And you're going to make way less money. You're going to have way less exposure because you're just going to be a doggone follower. And then my next question to you is, don't you want to do it right? Why would you be out there trying to figure this out by yourself? Queena, that's what we're talking about. If you sit and listen, get, that's another thing, guys. Without energy and effort, there is no revenue. Stop thinking it's as simple as how do I make money? And somebody tells you, oh, just do this, this and this. 
and you're going to ha oh, you're going to instantly be a millionaire. Fool, if it was that easy, wouldn't everybody do it? If it was that easy, wouldn't everybody do it? You jump in my broadcast. How do you make money? If it was that easy, wouldn't everybody be doing it right now? Girl, just do this, 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 and this. Who, girl, that's it? Yeah. That's it, girl. If it was that easy, wouldn't everybody do it? Without energy and effort, there is no revenue. Let me tell you something else. Without care and concern. Come through care. Come through concern. If you don't care about people and all you care about is making money, you'll never have no money. Without care and concern, there is no revenue. You know what, Charlene? I teach you guys that in class. Charlene's question was, do you map out your content beforehand or do you tune into what's downloaded to you that day? There's different ways to do it, but you've got to, let me go ahead and go down here to number six. When you scope, it's got to be pertaining to your marketing calendar. When you go live, it's got to be pertaining to your product, your service, Whatever your focus is at the time. You cannot be all over the place. I will teach you how to create a marketing calendar. You've got to have one. You've got to have one. How many of you do not have a marketing calendar or do not know what it is? Say me. Let's see who tells the, let's see who tells, like, it's, like the little rap song say, I tell the truth. Let me see who either does not have a marketing calendar or if you don't know what one is, say me. They telling the truth. Hey, they over on Periscope confessing. All right, Instagram is confessing. We ain't seen but a couple of people confess on Facebook. Somebody lying to kick it because I know you don't know what a marketing calendar is. I know you don't. I know you don't. And until you have one, you're not going to be able to offer the products and services that are consistent with what's on your product shelf, which brings me, which brings me, hold on, let me, let me see where it is, which brings me to number four. If you're not careful, you're going to give away too much knowledge. Look at your neighbor and say, Wow. If you're not super careful, you will get on this periscope and you will teach them so much that they do not need your class. If you're not careful, you will get on this live stream and you will teach them so much that when it's time for them to take your class, they're like, uh, what I need your class for? You done already gave me all this free knowledge. There is a line. How many of you are guilty of that? And how many of you have seen that? I see people. I'll go back over them real quick, Dana. I see people who sell soap doing classes on how to make soap. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You just going to come on live stream and just show folks how to make the soap. You're not going to charge them for no workshop. You're not going to write no book and sell it. No rest, no book, no soap recipe book. See, that's what I teach you how to do. Hey, Deirdre, you've been missing love bug. That's what I teach you how to do. I teach you how to take that stuff that you would have gave away for free create a product for it, and sell it. You just up there teaching the people how to make dial, lever 2000. You teaching them how to make Irish spring, zest. <laughs> you teaching them how to make caress. You just teach dove. You just teaching them how to make all the soap. Like my, like my auntie say. 
suave. You just try, you teaching them how to make all the soap. All of it. Dove. What's the white box? Uh, ivory. Calgon. You just teaching them how to make all the soap. I just said that, Jerry. Times all the soap. And you're missing. I know it's funny, but you're missing tens of thousands of dollars by giving away your stuff. Yes, I do teach you how to package your product. Hey, Kim Dixon. I do teach you how in this live stream class, I teach you to create products from free to the thousands. bit.ly slash live stream you. Y-O-U. I teach you if they ain't got but 20, I teach you how to pick it up. If they got 2,000, I teach you how to pick it up. And listen to me. Just say me if you want all the money. Just say me real quick. Because see, a lot of people specialize in smile products. They get all your 20s. And then there's other people that specialize in the big products. They get your thousands. See me, I want all the money. Whether you got two, 20, or 2,000. And if that's you in business, if you look at that link, go to bit.ly slash live stream you, Y-O-U. I'm going to show you how to make small products, uh, medium products, medium products, large products, and extra large products. I'm going to show you how to make them, pack a, package them, and, and price them. If you're somebody that is struggling with your price points, you need to get in this class. Because you will sit up on live stream and give away your knowledge. And I know it's funny, but it is true. If you want this list I'm speaking of, number one is content. Make sure you, that's it, CC's two cents. Make sure you text the word scope to 832 Four four seven two eight two two, eight three two four four seven two eight two two. Matter of fact, for those of you who text scope to eight three two four four seven two eight two two, coach might just have a discount for you on the class. Now, cash crew and montage everything, y'all already got your discount. But everybody that text scope to eight three two four four seven two eight two two, I just might have a discount for you. Just might have a little surprise for you. Just a little something for you. Off the class. You know, just to help you out. So, number one was your content has to be fresh. We're talking about how do you use live stream to make mega cash. Number one, you've got to have fresh content. You cannot be using, stealing, and borrowing other people's stuff. And it's done a lot. Number two, it's got to be relative. It's got to be what your target thinks is important, not what you think is important. Number three, it's got to pertain to what you have to offer. I can't be over here scoping and live streaming about fried chicken if I'm trying to get you to visit my car wash. I can't be over here scoping and live streaming about weight loss if I'm trying to get you to buy my brownies. A lot of people be on here with such made up content and baby, if they just had one or two little classes, they'd be able to figure out how they got it wrong. But number three, it's got to pertain to your brand and to your offerings. You will rarely ever see me do a scope this off brand. It, it, so let's talk about growing your followings real quick. In six months on Facebook, I've, grown, I've gone from 5,000 friends and 3,000 followers to 5,000 friends and almost 15,000 
followers. I have grown my Facebook following by 12,000 targeted. This ain't no men trying to get my number. This ain't no uh, catfishes following me. I have grown my Facebook following by 12,000 targeted followers within six months. That's ridiculous. I'm not organically, sis. No Facebook ads. I'm not a, I'm not a celebrity. Shoot, I ain't even got no hair. But when they see these live videos, they come and they come back. Just like you, Charlene. Because I don't know you. Where you come from? Look at yourself. Where'd you come from? I got almost 100 people right now on Periscope. Got over almost 100 people on Facebook right now. Well, y'all, hopo who these people? <laughs> hopo. Hopo. <laughs> hopo. Who these people? <laughs> Hello? But you will be too if you know what you're talking about and you know what you're doing. And, and you can beast it out every day on live stream. Let me tell you something. Ooh, ooh, these people. It is a matter of showing up, being who you are. That's right, Ruth. Authenticity, being who you are. But the longer you do it, the better you get at it. The longer you do it, the better you get at it. So number, number, number three was pertaining to your product offer. Number four is my big warning. If you're not careful, you will sit here and give away all of your knowledge. A lot of people think that giving away your knowledge makes it good content. But that, that's not the truth. One of the things that I teach women every day, hey, Stacy, one of the things that I teach women every day is that it's, 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 it's just like it's just like Erica Badu say, you got to hold on to some of yourself. If you get on live stream and, and preach your heart out and teach your heart out, you're going to wonder why nobody's buying your devotionals, why nobody's buying your, your books, why nobody's signing up for your courses. And it's because you've given them everything. You've got to, which brings me to number five. Look at your, look at your friends and say number five. It's just like dating, y'all. It's just like dating. Why buy the cow if you can get the milk for free? If they come by your house and every day you get them free, 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 they not going to ever buy a cup of milk. They're just going to keep coming by and getting it for free. That's the truth. Why buy the cow when you can get the milk for free? Which brings me to number five. Your content has still got to be good enough that they know you're the expert. See, that's what I teach you. I teach you how to let folks know unequivocally and without a shadow of a doubt that you are the expert. Say, it's a lot of folks out there good at what they do. I know I'm the expert. And I show up every day and prove it. It's a lot of folks good at what they do. I'm not taking nothing for nobody. But I know what God gave me. And I know how hard I've worked to develop it. So every day when I show up, I kick the dough in. And I say, if you're looking for expert, like Miss say, you're looking for me. Here I go. The girl right here. Hey, you looking for me. Anybody looking for me? <laughs> You've got to have content that lets folks know you're unequivocally the expert. There shouldn't be a, hey, Frazier, there shouldn't be a shadow of a, die, of a doubt. Number four was don't give away too much L. There shouldn't be a shadow of a doubt. So when I say, hey, sign up for my class, you might check your wallet, but you don't even have to check and see if I'm the expert. But, but if you do want to check, 
Go on Google. Get on your Uncle Google and put my name in and see what comes up. It comes up with expert status. It comes up with that. Yeah, so so bottom line is you can't give away too much, but there's a fine line between giving away too much and showing you're the expert. That's number five. Anybody ready for number six? I got y'all today. Do you want to make some mega, mega cash on live stream? That's what we're doing. One, two, three, four, five. Who ready for number six? Your content has got to drive people to your website. There is a big misconception nowadays that you should be driving people to your social media. That's a lie, y'all. That's a lie. It is less about how many followers you have on your social media and more about how many people are going to your website and actually looking at your products and looking at your services. And that lie was played out with MySpace. And let me tell you why. Folks that was bawling on MySpace turned around and when MySpace died in the middle of the night, they didn't know what to do to get their followers back. Y'all remember that? Some of y'all ain't old enough, but y'all remember that? Once they make it to your website, they ready to break bread with you. What they gonna buy off your Facebook? Most of y'all ain't even got links to buy nothing on your Facebook. You ain't got to worry about stopping by my Facebook to like nothing on my page. You can go straight over to my website and click the buy button. If you can't get them to your website. You can't get them to spend money with you. If you cannot get them to your website. You cannot get them to spend money with you. Not a dollar. Not a dollar. So your content should be driving people. At a, I think I get about 60,000 hits a month on my website. Your website should be driving droves, or as some people say groves, of people to your website. They should be going to your website in groves, <laughs> like mangoes, <laughs> like apples and oranges. What about a Facebook group? What about a Facebook group? Let's go there. That's number seven. Most of you guys have Facebook groups and you don't even have the people that are in the groups on your email list. Y'all wanted to go there? I went there. That's it. I went there. Y'all wanted to go there? I went there. We there now. We there now. That's number seven. Your content should always be growing your list. Your list is your second set of money. Your list is your second set of money. Your website is your first set. Your list is your second set. And I'm going to teach you in live stream university how to make growing your list. There ain't but two priorities for live stream. It's to make money and grow your list. Hey, Portia. There go my brand manager, y'all. They'll keep me on my toes. That's who keep me on my toes. I got Portia and I got Troy. They're my two coaches, and they keep me working hard. Hello? There ain't but two reasons for you to be on live stream. It's to make money and grow your list. Now, with that being said, how many of you don't have at least a 1,000 people on your list? Say me. Because you sign up for live stream university, we're going to change that. Go ahead. Let's tell the truth. We're going to tell the truth today, baby. This is like church, y'all. This is like church, baby. They say the truth will set you free, but you got to acknowledge the lie first. You've been ignoring your email list. I did it. I did it my first two, three years in business. Portia was trying to teach me the importance of growing my email list, and I just didn't get it. 
until one day it clicked. Yeah, come to the altar. Tell the truth and shame the devil. Come on now. Until one day it clicked. All of these people that I got following me on social media. And they not all on my list. Hey, Joanna, thank you for coming from the Virgin Islands to see me, baby. So what I've done is I've wasted two or three years. And if you talk to most digital marketer, marketers, the big wigs, Brendan Burchard and Ryan Dice and Russell Brunson, they will tell you I, they made the same mistake. They did not grow their list. Nope, Jer Jerlise, it's two different. it's two different things. The Cash Crew is a monthly membership group. Live stream, live stream University is a 16-week course. It's live stream you. bit.ly slash live stream you. Don't make those same mistakes. If you make $100,000 a year in your business, you can easily, uh, nobody, nobody, Mickey, just myself. For the first year and a half, just me. No assistant, no admin. Her question was, how many people did you have uh, helping you at first? Nobody. Then I met my business partner, Rashima. So for another year, it was just me and her. And I think about the three-year mark is when I started onboarding people. Which is why it's instrumental. If you are a solopreneur, and you don't have much time, you've got to know the systems that are going to make you the most money for the least amount of time investment. I'm going to be honest with you. You almost can't afford not to be on live stream. Hold on. Let me show you why. Let me show you why. So far on Periscope, I've had 574 people view this broadcast. Now, I'm going to ask you to type in me if you're going to see 574 people today. If you're going to see 600 people today, I've already saw a couple thousand this morning. I've probably got about a thousand that have seen this broadcast on Facebook. It'll be another thousand on, on Periscope. And so, can you type in me, please, if you're going to see 2468. 8,000 people. Wait a minute, because I'm not even done. I got a special broadcast tonight at 7 p.m. It ain't about getting there, Venus. I'm about to take people there now. Let Tell me when you get there, baby. Doing it by yourself. See, that's the thing. Nobody wants to admit they need help. You want to go out there and dig your ditch uh, on your own instead of saying, Coach, teach me how to dug it. Let me borrow your bulldozer. You understand what I'm saying? It took me two years to get here. You don't have two years to try to figure this out. It took me two years to get here. Do you have, in two years, the landscape of live stream will have changed so tremendously. Because it's changed in a year. It's changed in two. So the bottom line is, are you going to go on this journey or are you going to try to figure it out? So number six was drive people to your website. Number seven was drive people to your list. Uh, number eight is got to be informative. Live stream will single handedly change who you are as an orator. It will single-handedly change who, Arena, I can't help it. I can't help it. I love music. It will single-handedly change who you are as a business owner. It makes you get smarter because it makes you have to have something to talk about. If you think about a pastor that has to deliver a sermon every Sunday, 52 sermons, Right? Then your pastor got to be in the Bible. He got to be in the word. Somebody say amen if you understand what I'm saying. He got to be in the word so that he knows what he's talking about 
when he jump up in that pulpit, right? So a pastor does a sermon a week. Most live stream broadcasters, for all intents and purposes, I'm not saying I'm no pastor. I'm not saying I'm no preacher or no bishop. I am certified clergy. I, I'm not saying none of that. I am a certified reverend, but I'm not saying that. I'm saying I have to prepare a minimum of one sermon a day. So while a preacher prepares 52 a year, I prepare a minimum of 365. Always, Donna, once the course is over with, you get the you get access to the course content. Not only that, you get life you get lifetime access to live stream university. So if I release that same course, you can come back through that same course for a refresher because stuff changes. Hey Darius. So if a pastor has to prepare 52 sermons, and I'm gonna go live every day. I got to prepare 365. And guess what? That's right, Rochelle. I, I say I prepare closer to 2,000. But it's one of those things that once you know the formula, it is not hard. That's what I tell them, Mickey. I'm not a prophet. I'm a P-R-O-F-I-T. Once you know the formula, it's not hard. I'm going to show you how to do it in a way that you're going to be like, you're going to be smacking the easy button. That was easy. If you want the notes from all of the sessions I'm going to be doing in this series, go to eight, take, text the word scope to 832-447-2822. And again, you may just get a discount on live stream university. Those of you who text. Text the word SCOPE, S-C-O-P-E, to 832-447-2822. But I'm going to tell y'all, it's, it's some words to be, you know, this, this is more to it than meets the eye. It, it's more to it than meets the eye. Last but not least, y'all ready for number nine? Y'all ready? Y'all ready for this? Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Y'all ready for this? Number nine, show me some nines. Why well, give me a sip of not necessarily rebranding, Mickey, but we'll show you how to get started if you have a new idea. Sure, the number again is text scope to 832 447 2822. 832 447 2822. To get the lineup of what I'm going to be scoping about for the next eight scopes in this series. Number nine is you have to create uh, a tsunami of excitement so that people follow you. Good, sis, you're welcome. You've got to create a tsunami of excitement. So that people follow you. I've been doing this two years. And so for me to still be able to get people excited. It starts June 3rd at 8 a.m. It's a Saturday, 8 a.m. Is, is, it's a skill. And once you get people excited, they follow you. And they buy your stuff. Now, here's the thing. It's okay, Dakeisha. The replay is going to be, I used to be Charlene. I'm not anymore. I pop up now. Let me tell you something. Um, I'm going to teach you how to create excitement. And it's going to be up to you to do it. But there is an art. Because for me to still be able to do it two years later, trust me, there's an art to it. And that's what you need to know. 
is how to create those waves of excitement so that people are still looking for you and your content. This class is so amazing, y'all. The connections in this class, the partnerships, the collaborations, the knowledge, the learning, the growth, who you're going to become after Livestream University is amazing. Um, uh, it, it will help you with that, Mickey. It will. And, and, and it'll help you learn how to have a shelf to put them on. Hey, Judy, Judy, those ice cream cone, uh, cupcakes was super cute. Not tomorrow, Scott. We got to wait till next Saturday, June 3rd. I got you though. bit.ly slash live stream you. Yes, beautiful MUA. If you've got ideas that are on paper that you have yet to commit to a business, I'm going to show you how. If you've got ideas on paper that you have yet, who, who am I talking to right now? I know I'm talking to somebody. Who am I talking to right now? Say me. Who's got ideas on paper? That they have yet to put out there. I knew it was you sis. You brought it up. Thank you love. When you gonna. When you gonna birth them. Do you know what happens when you don't birth. Do you know what happens. When you don't give birth. To what's already inside of you. Do you know what happens. You get sick. That, that stillborn becomes toxic. Look at your neighbor and say wow. Did you know that when you don't birth what's inside of you, what's growing inside of you, what's bursting to get out, it becomes stillborn and it becomes toxic and it will make you sick. That's why people are depressed. It, it, it's not that they are depressed. It's that they're not using their gifts. And their talents. And their skills. And they know they're capable of more. They know that more is waiting for them. And they, in some cases, they just don't know how to do the detox by themselves. They don't know how to package it. And they don't know how to put it out there. Don't allow that to continue to be you. Go to bit.ly slash live stream y-o-u. The link is in my bio on Periscope. Make a commitment. Sign up today. Sign up today. Don't wait on let me see. Let me think about it. Let me ask somebody. But let me tell you what Tamira did. Tamira said, I'm not finna play with my future. I'm not finna play with my ability to make this mega cash. I'm not playing with my ability to leave this job. I'm going to invest $99 a week and I am going to sign up today. Some of you are going to, you're going to, you're going to drag your feet and you're going to miss the opportunity of a lifetime because the time you get back, it'll be $200. You know, that's supply and demand. Do y'all know how much my very first scope school was? It was just scope school. I didn't teach Facebook Live or Instagram Live. I didn't teach uh, product creation. I didn't teach sales funnel, which I'm doing in this one. But do you know how, to, how much the first one was? And if you was a student, do not guess. Somebody guess how much the first class was. How much was it a week? I'm going to show you a lesson and opportunity. How much was it a week? Somebody guess. Oh, but that's all right, Dakeisha. We still in there. Um, Geraldise, you would be better off. Nope, it was cheaper than that, Dakeisha. Dakeisha said $47. If you sign up for Cash Crew first, you're going to get the discount offer for Livestream University, but you're better off signing up for Livestream University first and get the 16 weeks of the Cash Crew free. It was $25 a week. For 10 weeks. 
Nope, Joanna, it was 25. The first round. Nope, Berlin, it was it was cheaper than 29. It was $25 a week for 10 weeks. Since then, of course, the course has evolved. The content has evolved. It's changed tremendously from that very first course. It's, it's more intuitive. It's more detailed because that was a year ago. And look at how much I've learned in a year. And not only that, look at how much live stream has changed in a year. Yep, if you sign up for Live Stream University, you get 16 weeks of the cash crew for free. There are people probably under the sound of my voice right now that a year ago, before I earned $600 plus thousand dollars on live stream, I said, come go on this journey with me. I said, come on live stream. Let me teach you how to do this. Let's work together as a family. And there were people who said no to $25. There's always going to be people that don't see the future. Don't let that be you. You don't have to keep struggling to generate revenue. Revenue is relative. And yeah, it's $99 a week now. But I promise you, if you look in your lunches and in your dinners out and in your grocery bill and in your closet, and in your bathroom, pantry, your linen closet, as my grandma calls it, you can find $99 a week if you're ready for this journey. But the truth of the matter is, you're going to grow so much on live stream. This is such an amazing personal development opportunity. You can't afford not to go. If you're on Periscope, the link is in my bio. Guys, and this is just part one. This is just content. And there's so many bonuses, including two transferable tickets to my live stream reunion in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Somebody say, hey. Because I'm a firm believer that you've got to meet people offline. All your relationships can't be online now. At some point, you got to even see if I got legs. It was like a hundred plus people that got to see me this weekend in Indianapolis. Another over 200 on live stream. And guess what they realized? Coach has legs. Some of y'all ain't seen me outside of the, the live stream. You don't even know if I got legs from the bottom down. You got to meet people offline. So you get two tickets to, um, you get two tickets to Fort Lauderdale. I got legs, y'all. You got to come see me to know that. But reminder, reminder, reminder for the live stream university group and for the cash crew, 7 p.m., $8 million lessons I learned during the race to freedom. It's going to be amazing. Don't miss it. Eight. Million dollar lessons. I, man, I'm hunting for a million like the hunt for Red October. You ain't never seen me walk sharing. You don't know. I'm on a hunt for, as a matter of fact, I'm on a hunt for multiple millions like the hunt for Red October. And so everywhere I go and everything I do, I'm looking for opportunities to say, this is what's going to close the gap. This is what's going to close the gap. Are you looking for what's going to close your gap? So at 7 p.m., I'm going to be doing that presentation on um, uh, $8 million lessons I learned during this event that we hosted in Indianapolis, Indiana this weekend. And if I had an energy, I'll come back and do part two of how you're missing mega cash by not using live stream, okay? I'm going to get out of here, guys. I appreciate you guys. You guys are amazing. Do not miss this opportunity. If you want the outline of what I'm going to be presenting over the next few days, 
If you text the word SCOPE, S-C-O-P-E, to 832-447-2822, you can catch it, okay? Love you guys. See you later. Bye-bye. They're not off yet, Troy. They hear you. Oh. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Shit. Damn. Man, look at your father's suit. Your mother's a little sandwich. Oh, you want to eat some? No, eat already. Oh.